Good morning, YouTube. My name is JB Hertzler. I'm with Hertzler Capital and World Broadcast Channel. Uh, I wanted to do what I do every day um, to show you how I relax and tune in with myself in order to be a more productive person. So I've been doing Kundalini Yoga for over 20 some years and I'm a, a certified teacher through uh, KRI Institute. So um, I'm going to run through my morning routine. It's a uh, going to do a short one so then you can kind of get an idea and if you have any questions you can always email me comments or whatever. Um, so I stimulate the nerve endings by rubbing the bottom of my feet and my hands together. There's 72,000 nerve endings in the hands and feet. All right, I'm going to press them together at my heart center, putting about 10 to 15 pounds of pressure. And then I tune in with Om Namo Guru Dev Namo to tune into my higher self. And then Ad Gare Name, Jagad Gare Name, Sat Gare Name, Siddhi Guru Dev Name for protection. Om That's the tune in. And then I usually start with some light music. Let's see if it. And then I do Ego Eradicator. I push my fingertips into the mounds, and then I have my thumbs out, hands at a 60 degree angle, thumbs pointing to each other, eyes rolled up, and breath of fire, picturing a bright white light surrounding you. chakras, um, which is an energy point um, in the uh, Hindi tradition. Um, so it's something good to, st um, to study, to understand, and um, I think I might be having a book come out soon on the chakras. Um, it's super important to understand how that works. So. The first chakra is knowing that we're supposed to be here, free from fear and survival mode. And I have my fingers in Gyan Mudra, index finger touching the thumb, straight spine, eyes closed, breath of fire. Beautiful. 
Now the second chakra, its element is water and it is um, blocked by sheen. Um, and uh, it's basically the flow of our sexual energy. And this one is called Supi Grind Sura. Inhale forward, exhale back. direction This one is for our um, second and third chakra, which second is for our sexuality and water, and third chakra is our, our belly, and that is um, black bite shame also, um, and it's also the fire. This is how we digest our food. So we have earth on the low one, second is water, third is fire. So we're going to be working with both the second and third energies on this one. We're going to do spinal flexes, hands right at our shins. And we're going to inhale forward, exhale back. Free from guilt and shame. which is sitting on your heels, which um, they say you can digest rocks. Don't try that at home, but sitting in this pose. Okay, and we're gonna work specifically on the third chakra, getting rid of shame and guilt. <coughs> and again, we've got, we're working with the fire, the willpower. And now forward, spinal plexus here, exhale. center air it's blocked by grief blocked by grief and shame and it allows us to give and receive love easily and effortlessly and the <coughs> the element is air and the color is green all right so we're gonna put our hands fingers front thumbs in the back on our shoulders we're gonna inhale left Exhale right.
shoulder shrugs. Same working with the heart, working up to the throat center, which is our source of truth blocked by lies. circulation. Speak and hear the truth free from lies. Lies that we tell ourselves or lies that we want to believe by other people. Get it, Yogi. This is, this is basically a modified cut cat cow where hands are directly under the shoulders, knees are directly under the hips, and I start out with uh, the breath of fire and then get into the movement. Are you going to do it with me, Yogi? Okay, and this is for the, the uh, third eye or um, the sixth chakra, intuition blocked by illusion. Now this final practice. Inhale, cow. Exhale, scared cat. exercise for for this series for the chakras <coughs> is for the seventh chakra the crown chakra the um, basically the pineal uh, gland pineal pituitary gland and um, it's our connection with divine source and this one our, our fingers are usually like this on on when we're doing this where the for men it's right over left but for this one it's left over right for men and opposite for women and the hands are just right over the crown chakra and it's um, blocked by attachment attachment to earthly things so begin breath of fire okay and this is for the crown chakra and again the left is over the right thumb for men, women it's right over left. Usually it's opposite when we're in the Venus lock, but this one is different. So we're gonna have our hands right over our crown chakra, eyes rolled up to the third eye, begin breath of fire. sadhana which is a morning practice to connect with your spiritual self is to take a, a little shavasana lay down listen to some gong music uh, and relax and connect with yourself uh, 
All right, well, let's do our morning meditation. This is Sudarshan Chakra Kriya, which we, I do it a different way. I, <laughs> like I try to do everything my own freaking way. But anyway, with the right hand, I'm blocking my right nostril and I'm inhaling. And then I drop mine down and I hold it in Gyan Mudra, index finger and thumb meet. And then on the exhale, I use the same right hand, but the index finger block the left nostril and exhale off the right. And so while the whole time I'm inhaling and I pump, pump my diaphragm. So while, hey, guru. Wahe Guru means like amazing, awesome, amazing things. Guru is a teacher that brings us from darkness to light. All right. And on this one, I close my eyes. A lot of people, some people will do it with, with, with your hands right up here. And they never move. That's fine. Whatever floats your boat. Whatever works and allows you to tune in with yourself that you need to. All right.
end my morning routine and classes with this song because it's great from Sanan Kaur. Sun. Wait a long time, sunshine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you. Hope you were able to make it through that whole set and you're able to feel the difference within yourself. Sad not. <laughs>